think it's such a bad precedent being set if that indeed happens for the future of this country. And I think a lot of people have said the same thing. Why is it that you would need to do blanket pardons like that if no one is guilty of anything? I think it leads people in this country to say, wow, these folks must have done something pretty bad that they're going to have to go out of their way to get preemptive pardons, things for which they haven't even been charged yet. Um, And and I I really hope we don't see that. I think the American people are desperate to get back to a place, Howie, where they can trust these fundamental and foundational institutions of our country, like our Department of Justice. Doing things like that, I think, leads us down an opposite path. And I think it makes people feel like, you know, the past four years, maybe there's a lot more to hide that they really need to get to the bottom of. Um, So I really hope we don't see that happen. What about the president pardoning his son, Hunter, who, by the way, is a 54-year-old convicted criminal? Yeah. Yeah. Listen, um, I, I you heard Donald Trump say he wasn't really surprised by that. And I think a lot of us maybe weren't surprised by it, despite the fact that Joe Biden time after time after time said, I won't do that. I won't pardon Hunter. I believe in the process. I believe in the Department of Justice. And then I think to see his statement when he came out and said that it was because Hunter was targeted that there everybody knows any reasonable person would would know that this mm-hmm. was specific to Hunter because he was targeted because he's my son. No, no. Hunter Biden broke the law. And I think a lot of people went those charges were brought forward against hunter said oh well we all believe that this is a way they say oh look we charged hunter with something the really big stuff like i don't know jeopardizing our national security what really happened in ukraine and russia and china how is it joe biden was involved in this we never heard about how we i think a lot of people thought they charged hunter with this to sweep it under the rug and now he's been pardoned for 10 years and whether or not we actually find out what happened I don't know, but the American people deserve that. And I think they demand that. And I think it's one of the big reasons that you see Donald Trump as our 47th president.